which is a mandatory pit stop. Christopher Mees has uh, got into the number one Audi, Audi so taking over from Colin. Oh, oh no! Oh, no. Is off! Oh, Christopher straight, Mees went off! Straight into the car which was leading the race, Luca Ludwig. Uh, Luca Stott's car, rather, has got damage, but it's going to survive. Fully around, gets going again. He can't believe it. Back in the uh, garage. Unbelievable, that. So that was, that was uh, coming out of the pitch, just getting on the throttle too heavily. Christopher Mees as well, with all of his experience as the defending champion. What's the damage like? Bit to the uh, left corner. So look at the Audi coming out of the pits. Can't believe this. And then gets on the throttle, gets out of shape. I think he was trying to get on the brakes and get out of the way, actually, at the Mercedes of Lucas Stoltz. Race leader sent out by a car which was rejoining from the pitch, just clipped the back, but at those speeds, it's enough to send him round and on the grass, and the two-second lead will have evaporated now. Uh, it still should be rejoining in the top five or six, I think, but I doubt he's going to be in the top three. Certainly not going to be leading the race. You saw the Porsche flashing through there. So Robert Renauer is going to hand over the Porsche as the race leading car now. Bam. Right on the corner there. It looked like he was caught in two minds, didn't it, as he came out of the pits. It looked like he got slightly out of shape and then saw this Mercedes coming through. The car was already out of shape, and I wonder if he hit the brakes then and then was caught in two minds. Obviously, exiting is under investigation, but it's a mistake from...